I want to demonstrate a very simple chart that shows what we're all about. It all starts here. If this collapses, everything else goes with it. This is the foundation for everything above it. If the foot rolls in, the leg turns in. The leg turns in, puts pressure on your knee. It continues to go in, and what will happen is your pelvis will drop, and it'll come forward and puts pressure across the muscles of your lower back. And then, of course, more strain in the lower back. Everybody has trouble in L4, L5, because that's where a lot of that pressure comes from. If you have a leg length discrepancy, your hip's going to be at an angle. That will change everything up and through here, including the line across your shoulders, and that in turn affects up into your jaw. So people who have temporal mandibular joint disease, they have trouble with their jaw, will often have trouble lower down. Not always, but the lower you go with problems, including leg length discrepancies, the more it will affect higher up.